response video was uh, a broken neck uh, his response to his response I guess um, yeah I made a video and it was really good you know I did a whole bunch of horrible <laughs> you know slanderous statements I made just horrible really not slander but you know what I mean just horrible um, attacks on uh, the character and uh, dignity of broken mech because he deserves it he deserves to be treated like the piece of shit that uh, he is <laughs> you know that he, uh, he's such a, a, a cheater he just cheats arguments every single time it's an argument he cheats the argument um, even if Bella believes that all life is equal which she doesn't but even if she did uh, that doesn't change again you're, we're talking about the difference between a seal and a human being both mammals okay the argument isn't about microbes or ears of corn or anything else that's not where the argument is and it certainly has nothing to do with my argument so to throw me in that category is just a cheat a big fat fucking ugly cheat all right so explain justify it show where in my video where I even implied I think all animals are equal where that was even implied ever it wasn't it's just something you made up because it makes it convenient for you to make a bullshit argument you're the fucking hypocrite you're the fucking bigot okay you're obviously human centric bigot you're no better than a religious fucktard who hates gays right what's the difference between a gay hater and somebody like you who would who would, would beat a seal to death with a fucking goddamn club because somehow it's better than you it's superior so if I take a two-year-old kid and I give it a test and I ask it to, to multiply seven times seven and it can't do it and I ask a seal to multiply seven times seven and it can't do it so they're equal right <laughs> so what's the difference is there a difference Wait, what standard are you using to justify what you will cause harm to are you going to be imbecilic enough to say that there's some sort of little magic sparkles inside of a human consciousness at two or three years old or a fucking human what about a human being who's uh, intellectually diminished or retarded are you going to make an argument that somehow what's going on for that thing psychologically is somehow more elaborate and sophisticated still than a moose or a antelope or uh, an elephant is that going to be your moronic fucktarded idiotic logically depraved argument jackass I mean you're the fucking like I said you're the one that with the duplicitous double standard hypocrisy uh, to justify your uh, your your disproportional treatment you're 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 going to make a differentiation based on something completely irrelevant all right so everybody should use you deserve bigotry you deserve exactly what you're willing to give other sentient creatures if you're not going to treat them uh, with the dignity they they deserve then why should you be treated with any fucking goddamn dignity you piece of fucking goddamn shit fucking aliens should come here and they should fucking beat you over the fucking head with a club you and your family and eat you okay fry you up and fucking eat you or rip your fucking skin off and say oh gee it makes me nice and fuzzy and warm uh, this bullshit argument too you know where somehow you're expecting Eva to defend nature Eva did not invent nature she did not in invent the dog her dog's uh, intestinal tract uh, but Eva knows too though that a dog lives on its blood like a human being it's what's in your blood okay your blood feeds your body and uh, yes you can have a vegetarian dog it's really not that difficult um, so you're you're so, so, so full of fucking goddamn shit um, you're just wrong you're a bigot plain and simple uh, you're the one with the duplicitous double standards uh, and uh, you absolutely fucking suck you're a shitty lousy crappy scummy human being like I said this is your argument tactic all right you didn't paraphrase me accurately or, or fairly you just cheated you're a little fucking weasel cheater um, and uh, I said that in a lot of different ways in the other video <laughs> yeah. but whatever fuck you all right you deserve exactly what you're willing to give the other sentient creatures we didn't invent this shithole all right uh, and, and some of us don't take any responsibility for it that's right I didn't I didn't procreate I didn't have kids I didn't say this is a good idea let's create more animals to feed on more animals it's cannibalism you dumbass you're too stupid to figure that out you really are you're too fucking stupid to figure that out when we enslaved the black people what were we enslaving we were enslaving ourselves weren't we were enslaving human beings okay it was only dumb asses who couldn't figure that out 
well, when you're eating all these other mammals, you're okay, uh, and abusing them, you're just abusing, uh, you know, relatives of yours a few uh, hundred thousand or million years ago. All right, there's not enough of a distinction for you to make such a big deal out of it. Okay, again, multiplying seven times seven does not make you feel. What what drives animals, what drives mammals, is a psychology, and there's nothing more elaborate about our psychology. We're more intelligent. We're more capable of reading books and writing shit down and, and conceptualizing uh, because we have a vocabulary. But, but, but wait, would you club Helen Keller to death before she learned language? Is that your fucking attitude? She just deserved to be clubbed to death because she was a dumb, ignorant animal before she learned language? Fuck you, you bigoted son of a fucking jackass cunt bastard. Yeah. <clears throat> anyway, I mean, the duplicity, hypocrisy, 